Let's go. Let's go. Go here in the D-pad. Where I'm John. I'm Rick. And that's Tentacruel. Pokemon Shine and Pearl. Yeah, we're uh, going through this part where we get to the part before the part where I die. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be good. We're gonna we're gonna stick a grain of sand in the Tentacruel and it's gonna make a pearl. I'm gonna rend it and see what happens. Special rend. It's got a lot of limbs, so it might take a minute. A spatial rend for my special friend. Nope. Uh, Did not yeah. even do much. Didn't do as much as I was expecting. No, man. I'm wor man. I feel like I got the <laughs> short end of the. It could be tough. <laughs> it could be really tough. Uh, maybe I should go blow all my money on protein and carbos or whatever. I mean, it's only going to matter for your legendary, and you. It, I, I definitely dumped a lot of stuff into, uh, into Akimbo yours. before yeah. before it got yeah. obliterated by a fucking mirror coat. <laughs> that one sucks. That's a brutal. Mirror code really, really yeah, sucks. I'm really as a trying way to, to burn that into my memory. Yeah. We probably won't get to the um, Elite Four for me today. Oh, we're definitely not. So I'm hoping we can at least get through Victory Road, but there's a good chance of that. I think that's right. I think that's probably like But it got late fast. Six or so episodes. Already. Jesus Christ. Yeah, yeah where did the fucking so time I was like, go? Jesus. I think we just we're having a good time catching up. Yeah. Um which is good too. That's important. I spoiled too. the entirety of Undertale, he more did. or less. I was like, "Oh, you're streaming Undertale?" He's like, "Yes." Let me tell you every part of the story and every <laughs> ending. I was like, "Okay." <laughs> it was cool though. It, it, it sounds. I'm more intrigued by it now yeah. than I was. I think it's a really good time, and I really wish that uh, the the fan base was not as like ah! unapproachable. I guess in yeah, some ways. That's, that's a way to put it. Um, it's definitely a little bit tough. Annoying at times. is what he means, but he doesn't <laughs> want to ostracize anyone. <laughs> I mean, um, no, they can be very annoying for sure. Yeah. Oh, no. What? He just gets to be absorbing stuff because he's yeah. on water? All right. This battle just got a lot longer than it needed to be. It just gave itself regen, too. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm just going to have to. <laughs> Did my thing not even work? All right, whatever. Yeah, if this has water water absorbed, then your oh, move that's just heals it. Was. it. Oh, yeah. that's cool. That's cool. Okay. At least it didn't make me watch the animation then. No, no, no. Okay. Um. I think there's, all, there's a few there's a few moves and abilities that have that. Like read more read. Good. Um, I'm gonna go out of. Oh come on! <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm oh. not feeling great. I mean, <laughs> his defense seems pretty good at least. Yes. But, uh, yeah. Being a legendary, even without boosts and EVs and things, holy shit! I mean, it is a ninety. It's ninety five accuracy, isn't it? Yeah, and it's Remoraid. Is he, like, <laughs> really good at not getting hit? Is that, like, his I special thing? I don't think so. Like, part of me wants to just sunk cost fallacy keep doing it, but... There you um, go. That was weird. Do, 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 it's not a, that's do, not a do, great do. portent no. For, uh, no. for the future here. Let's, uh, let's just make this quicker. <laughs> All right. But I will uh, persist. I will get through this. I'm excited to start a new Pokemon game someday. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this one, I think we can confidently say, was not our favorite. No. What do you think about that, Rick? Is that a hot take? No, I think that's a pretty... I think everyone more or less agrees. Like, yeah. the original was a fairly weak entry. I would say the original was pretty well considered the weakest of the original Pokemon games. Probably, you yeah. Know? I mean, Platinum did a lot to fix those problems. <laughs> a lot of things they did not take into account for this version. Yeah, for which is really disappointing. I think everybody yeah. was hoping for essentially a, a Platinum or Platinum inspired yeah. remake and then they didn't and it's like, oh man guys, right. you really... At least with Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald, Emerald added some stuff but it was more or less like it was already a pretty good game. And they just added a bit here and there to it to, like, they tweaked the story. They added some pieces. Platinum was a little bit more like, all right, we've got this whole extra thing going on. We've got a changed, like, conclusion for the for the fight and all that. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. they added more Pokemon, which don't exist in this version. Like, Darkrai is not in this game at all because it was made for Platinum. Which sucks. That's so stupid. It's still this generation. Yep. Like, also, why am I fighting six dudes right now? What? <laughs> all right. But, like... Someone's yeah, gonna I don't earthquake think, someone who shouldn't, and I'm gonna get in trouble. I think that's it's a, what's gonna happen. I think it's fairly popular opinion that that diamond and pearl, not platinum, but diamond and pearl are essentially the weakest entries of like old school Pokemon, and brilliant diamond and, Bril and shining pearl are basically the the worst remakes we've had so far. Yeah, it might be up against Let's Go, but even then, that has that that has more to do with they made changes that were like 
very different in that regard. Yeah, at least that, that's a different game, I yeah. think. It doesn't feel so much like Pokemon Red. It's a retool more than a remake. Yeah, of, that's a good way to put it. You know, This one's almost more of just a remaster. And I hate to say it, I actually think I... As much as I hate it, let's go. I don't know if this is better. I don't I'm, think it is. I'm I think I had a better sure. time with let's go. Yeah. Uh, Rock I, Tomb. I had mentioned a while back that I actually own I praise Pokemon you, Diamond. I had it when I was like a teenager, and I found my cartridge again yep. years ago, like while we were doing some other Pokemon game, and I pulled it up, and I hadn't even bothered to finish the game. I know. I remember. Me too. Yeah. It's the same thing. My cousin lent it to me, and I was like, oh, cool. I'll check this out. Yeah. And then I got to like the third town, and I was like, this is you not know, fun I at got, all. I got to like the sixth gym, and I just kind of gave up. Like, I was just not interested anymore. I was like, all right, well. Yeah. And honestly, this one, it just, yeah, it doesn't really do much for me. It, it sucks that like there's not a lot of plot going on. Team Galactic show like they're a little bit present but you don't really interact and then all of a sudden two thirds of the way through the game all of the interaction happens in one go yeah it's almost as bad as um pokemon what was the most recent one sun moon uh no sword and shield sword and shield where, scarlet where, violet's where, most recent one before where all the story was, happens off screen and yeah Leon, where they he, keep on the champion Leon, yeah and he's just like i took care of it yeah keep fighting like, it's like what? don't even tell me if you're gonna yeah if you're gonna prevent me from being there because also leon was like not all that impressive no. As a Pokemon trainer, anyway, so it really, it really kind of messes with the vibe. If you're like, "Oh man, here's our champion. He's gonna save the day." Also, it was very easy to beat him. No, it like, feels oh, like right. they were meant to be a dungeon there, and they ran out of time. Maybe, yeah. And I, I wouldn't. It wouldn't surprise me actually. Yeah, if they cut content and paved over it with Leon taking care of things. Right. Because like, yeah, no, it just it kept feeling like the game was going. Uh oh, something's going on. But you should do this. This is more important. And it's like, well. I'd rather go do that. It feels like in a. Are these both low priority moves? Uh, Revenge and vital throw. Probably. That yeah. seems like a problem. That might not be the best thing <laughs> for you now. Uh, they should tell you that the move goes last if it goes last. Yeah, I you mean, I mean one of them like, does on there, but the other one doesn't. And like but we looked it up, and it does. Well, so uh, um, we avalanche, looked up the avalanche does, which is the same text. Yeah, it looks like essentially the right. same. Right. Yeah. Right. I would appreciate a little bit more of a peek behind the curtain because, like, I don't love when moves are, like, vague with their descriptions to the point where you don't understand what's even happening. Right, exactly, yeah. and, and Like, that. a little badge that has, like, like a foot with a minus or, like, a blue foot or something. Like Yeah, just something to make me at least ask why. Or, like, a yeah. more info button that gives you all the details or yep. something, you know? like. Um, but I get it. Making games is hard. Yeah. It's a lot of steps. Yeah, there's a lot of steps, and and there's a finite amount of time in the end. But counterpoint, Nintendo has a team of hundreds and millions of budget, and Pokemon is one of the it biggest is, franchises in the world. It is, I believe, they could put in a little more effort. By by <laughs> some metrics, it is the uh, best-selling franchi media franchise on the planet. Yeah, like Pikachu's more recognizable than Mickey Mouse. Yep. So. And like, yeah, I, I I was very glad to see. Much as I would like there to be some kind of, you know, Pokemon thing, I was very glad to see Legend ZA, which I think was the best, like, the best put together game in recent memory. Like, it felt the tightest in terms of, like, design and execution. What do you mean, like, the, from the preview? Uh, no, I mean, like, uh, Scarlet and Violet had, like, a lot of graphical weirdness going on yeah. and a lot of slowdown in areas and... Oh, you uh, mean Legends Arceus? Legends Arceus, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. What did I say? You said ZA. Oh, sorry. Well, so... My, I'm glad to see that ZA is not getting shoved out for November. They're doing it in the spring, okay. Which means they're giving it at least a little bit more time. Another four or five months could not possibly hurt it. Yeah. Uh, and also, Legends was one that was well put together the first time around for Arceus. So, like, I'm hoping that the same mentality goes into this, and they have a like tight experience with that one. Yeah. And then on top of that, this is this is like they're also not shoving out. Gen 10 or another remake this year, which means, okay, those can also take a little more time. That would be like, great. Like, actually button them up, actually yep. get the quality down. Like, Yeah, I'm hoping, you know, because, like, you, there are some interesting ideas in Scarlet Violet. There's some interesting ideas yeah. in Arceus. Mm -hmm. So it's like, if they can synthesize all this into, like, a good game. There's a nearly perfect Pokemon game somewhere at the right. intersection between those. That's that's what I'm hoping, yeah. At God least, a, at least a nearly perfect for now, right? Like that'll yeah. always change. But yeah. I think what people are hungriest for is somewhere in between those. Yeah, and don't shove Pokemon Go mechanics into it. Yeah, Go <laughs> needs, Go needs, needs to, to kind to of fade away. There needs to be a Go to or like a Pokemon different yeah. verb 
like a, a new it thing seems, that's better. It seems like this is mostly from the outside, but it does kind of seem like Pokemon Go is starting to wind down a little bit. It I mean, seems it's like been the, a while now. Yeah, it seems like the popularity is kind of drifting a little, but they still have community events and things that have huge numbers, so it could just still be going, and it's just not you know not that, slowing down. Enough. I don't understand why that move isn't better. Which one? Spatial rend. It's a one hundred stab move, and it's effective. Yeah, I'm just surprised, and it's supposed to be critting sometimes too. Yep. I'm just would think I would think it would be better. Yeah, I don't know. You should check your. Uh, you should check your actual my stats and my EVs stats, and like what shit. your up and down, like yeah. what your nature effects are, because that could be affecting things too. Right. You might have something that brings your special. I might have a nature down. that just like hates living. <laughs> Let's see. Um, I guess I'm still good on health, and then you check summary. To the right, too, I think. He's impish by nature. Okay. That's my uh, hip hop album. Um, so special attack is down. Yeah. So that's why they're even. Your your offensive capabilities are just kind of stunted on on <sighs> yours. Great. Because I think both. Yeah, both of them are supposed to be good. Special and there's just attackers. nothing you can do about that, right? Uh, you could you could shove it full of special attack drugs. I will until its EVs are maxed out. I will. Um, I it mean, does have better physical defense than it would normally have, so it is tankier it than usual, feel, which is very tanky. you. Yeah. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I, it's just it, it like the most. He means me thread, as a person. I'm a tanky the, person. The most he saw me take thread. a punch and not even flinch. Yeah, it happened. He punched himself. <laughs> it was weird. Yeah. Uh, the no, most of your teams in these games tend to be very bulky. Yep. Uh, they just tend to like be very resilient well, ones. Know, where I tend I to opt it. more for speed and attack. Yeah. I, I don't even think I do it on purpose. I think it just kind of happens. Yeah, I don't think I don't think it's an intentional thing. It's just what you wind up with for a team. Mm. And so much of this stuff revolves around luck too, right? Like truth. It really does come down to what you get as your draws. I barely know how to properly pl like play a Pokemon game anymore. See, Did that really live with one hit point. Was that a crit? It didn't say it, so I think that was just a regular hit and just happened to barely, barely but miss. But something's weird, because that's still... That's 80, and even though my attack's a few points higher, it's not... Something's really w weird. Mm. That just seems like it should be I think be Tentacruel is just a little totally bit wrong. dense. Oh, maybe his special defense is yeah. really high. That must be what it is. My brain. Let's do some stat hunting. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 All right, the base do, stats. Do, do, do. Yeah, it's special defense is 120. It's its, oh, okay. it's its best stat. Okay, that, that at least makes me feel a little better. Yeah, physical defense is 65. So you're way so, better off with yeah, Dragon Claw Yeah, good right to now. know, good to know. I like... You said those Pokemon Center right before Victory Row, yes. right? yep. So I'm going to keep yeah. struggling through because I don't feel like going back. At the end of this route, there's... Uh, there's yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, dash Koo, Dash Koo. Yeah. So All right, Crystal. Crystal Light. Or is it more like Crystal Lake? Uh, is that which one's the iced tea? <laughs> Crystal Lake is the iced tea. Ice tea plays. <laughs> iced tea plays. Uh, uh, Jason Voorhees. So yeah. Wow. Nice. Yeah. Thank you. There you go. Not a lot of people know that. It's the mask. It really hides. It makes it a lot harder to tell. Bird. <laughs> I think is is Crystal Light iced tea? I guess it. No, Crystal it's Light is powdered garbage that well, they yeah, call iced yeah. tea. I used to drink it a lot Instant as a kid, tea, yeah. and I would get heartburn. My really brain bad. has a hard time <laughs> separating Crystal Light from. There's like a brand of wine cooler that's very, very similar to Crystal mm. Light, and I cannot. Man, I haven't thought of wine cooler in a I long know. time. We're we're get we're closer to forty than thirty. We have to start thinking about wine coolers. <laughs> I got an argument with Dustin today. Yeah, and I had I told Rick about this. I we had lunch today before this. I was uh, you know I hadn't seen him in a while and. Uh, He's like, yeah, man, I'm, uh, I'm almost forty, and I'm like, well, you're not, you know, you're not that old, dude. And he's like, no, man, I'm turning thirty nine this year, and I was like, Dustin, no, you're not. <laughs> he's like, no, man, I'm thirty eight. I'm gonna turn thirty nine, you know. And I'm like, no, Dustin, do the fucking math. You're not. You're turning thirty eight. And he's like, oh fuck, I am old. <laughs> so you know, he Going even texted Jana. He's, he's like, oh, we're only thirty eight. Oh my <laughs> god, on, dude. I'm sure that got a response back of like, yeah, yeah, <laughs> probably, yeah. Like, that's funny. Cross shot. Uh, that might not be bad. Yeah, to switch that might for be one good. of your other let's, ones. Let's forget. I think that's supposed to be a high, high power, low accuracy. One hundred eighty. Honestly, one hundred eighty with crit is not bad. It's only a little worse than spatial rend, right? User attacks last. This throw move never misses. 
That's that doesn't seem that good. That's the thing. Seventy is there a benefit? Is like a throw move like a special thing? Just throw. I don't think right. uh, there might be some extreme edge case, but I don't Fuck think it's it. going to really come up. We'll try it. Um, never misses is nice, but seventy. But seventy and 70 going with last and is going not last worth it. is a is a. If it was a hundred and always went last, yeah, okay, but that'd be like, a different story. Or like goes last, and if you take damage, it doubles it or something. Yeah, but. yeah, yeah. Right. Why don't we head to this little belly and up to the sandbar and, and fight this little sailor boy next time? I'm a rude. Bye.